Blackboard's latest release, 3900.80, um, is available today, uh, December 7th, um, and includes uh, a number of updates. Um, I want to take a few minutes today and just highlight a couple of those. So feel free to pause uh, and browse this list, and I'll also um, link the, um, uh, the updates page as well. One of the updates is now uh, an improvement to rubrics. So you can now have uh, essentially unlimited uh, rows and columns in your rubrics. Um, to access rubrics, you click the cogwheel, you scroll down to use grading rubric, add a grading rubric, click create. And then you can hover over to the sides here and click the purple plus sign as many times as you would like um, to add uh, new columns. And then to add new rows, you can scroll down to the bottom, click the purple plus sign, and add as many new rows as you would like. There have also been improvements with the ability to insert images. Um, so this is, has existed in some of the items um, prior to this update, but now has expanded to announcements, uh, assessment questions, student answers on questions, uh, submission feedback, and um, journal entries and comments. So, it had looked like this in documents before where you have this image pop up and you can select images from Unsplash, you can upload from the device, um, or you can drag and drop images in here as well. That's now been expanded to um, the other areas mentioned, um, such as announcements. So if you click announcements, create announcements, you know how that image feature here as well. Blackboard has also included uh, some updates to uh, sorting in grid view. So you were able to sort um, certain items um, in ascending or descending order uh, in the grid view uh, of the grade book before, um, but now that's been expanded um, to include all of these items, uh, which include discussions, uh, calculations, uh, group assessments and discussions and journals. Um, and you do this um, by clicking the little up and down arrow uh, next to the item in grid view. So that will put it in ascending order or descending order. And you can also deselect that way as well. Um, hope this helps.